Hi guys, uh, uh, this is Shantan. Um, I am here talking to you after a long time. I can feel the intensity of the present situation and um, yeah, it's a global crisis at present. I believe all of you are doing well, all of you are healthy. Please take care, follow all the rules and regulations from the government. Try to cope with the situation and uh, don't go outside because I'm seeing that people are not taking this thing very seriously. Um, I'm very much worried about the situation in India because a lot of people are not taking this thing seriously. They are going to the uh, marriage uh, programs, gatherings and all this. This is not good right now. Don't go in this kind of places so that you can't spread this kind of virus to the other people. You don't have any right to do that. A lot of people, those who ha have been just arrived at India, they are not taking uh, required precautions. They're meeting with friends, going to the shopping mall and this, that, which is very uh, bad. Even if you are not infected, please try, try to isolate yourself so that you and your family your friends everybody uh, become safe in this present situation um, i heard that tomorrow there is a curfew uh, in india from um, like 16 hours i think from uh, seven o'clock morning to uh, nine o'clock in the night uh, but this is not I think this is not a uh, good step you have to ask yourself that how to protect so like one day curfew is not okay you have to maintain that for yourself don't go out even if you are inside the uh, home don't uh, try to protect your family my point is try to protect your family as well as yourself and don't infect other people so i'm very much worried about the present situation um, because you know that in india uh, the population is uh, increasing day by day uh, uncontrollably so the thing is um, and the financial status of india is not that good now if this kind of thing will spread then uh, you can understand what we, what what will going to happen and uh, uh, so like it's a big crisis so for this moment, don't uh, think about any other problem in your life. This is the first problem. You have to uh, like isolate yourself. Then you can able to survive. This is the first thing you have to do. And uh, like these days, there are a lot of uh, like chat medias open uh, medias are there like facebook is one of them uh, through them through which you can actually connect with anybody like i'm talking with you and uh, also there is something called skype zoom the video there are and also google talk so this kind of video chatting sites you can use to talk to your uh, friends family and other people you don't need to go to their place please isolate yourself and uh, at least you, you 
all of all of you those who are a little bit uh, educated and heard about the present situation you will know that the growth rate of this uh, spreading the disease is actually increasing now your duty is to flatten that curve and that can only uh, be done if you isolate yourself so the thing is uh, a lot of people couldn't able to understand this thing the intensity of this uh, curve like if you isolate yourself you can flatten that and also at, after a certain time you will see that that curve the growth rate will fall so that's the main motto to isolate yourself because you can then have a lot of time to investigate about this virus so if uh, we don't do that and it will increase day by day day by day then i don't know what will going to happen uh, so you can like you have seen that uh, what is the present situation in italy it's very bad i'm very much uh, like in pain for the P italian uh, uh, friends of mine and those who are not also friends that they are suffering with this kind of situation but like as far as i know that italian people are very uh, social people they gather uh, in very uh, frequently and go to pubs and uh, and many many places and in italy there are lots of places where you can able to visit so uh, like a lot of people comes from abroad to visit italy like rome venice those places milan so i know that few people uh, actually borrowed that thing from china to there and this thing actually spreads from there but like whatever happened in italy and whatever going on at present it's like really horrible and i'm feeling really painful and i hope it will uh, only be controlled if we can able to isolate ourselves i don't know those who are already infected we can't do anything they have to believe on their uh, present medical facilities and all but those who are not infected please uh, like isolate yourself so uh, for me i can i can able to do, uh, tell you that i am actually a very uh, social person i i if you isolate myself then i just feel like to uh, like uh, mad but even since the situation is very uh, serious i have decided to isolate my myself not to meet any people not to go to any shopping mall restaurants and any other places i try to uh, like sometimes i have to come to my office to do some work but in my office there is no people so it's completely empty and uh, so and yeah like be safe be healthy and don't if you have this kind of problem disease or whatever any kind of symptoms uh, like fever or maybe some other symptoms uh, probably you guys already know from the uh, medical precautions and uh, the <coughs> regulations and uh, things uh, given by the who who so please follow their uh, instructions how to protect yourself but the main thing is you have to isolate that's the only way you can flatten the growth rate of this disease uh, i have also uh, seen that this is another interesting aspects people are started writing research papers on uh, the uh, to describe the catastrophe at italy and also whatever happened in china so 
uh, as a physicist, I can tell that people have started writing. So in biology, chemistry, people are writing many, many papers. But as far as I have seen, just two days ago, there is a paper in statistical mechanics in archive. People have tried to give some statistical models and uh, to describe this kind of growth. Some people are saying that this is kind of an exponential growth, but yeah, it is may not be exactly exponential. There might be some kind of a non-trivial uh, uh, dependence in time. So people are trying to find out what could be the possible uh, fitting formula for this growth rate. And uh, a lot of people from statistical mechanics community trying to understand this growth and with the different different models and all. Uh, yeah, so everybody is trying to find what is the reason and why it is growing so fast. Medical teams are working uh, in different, different places very hard, uh, try to respect their uh, effort. So uh, like they are spending uh, the whole time to recover all of you, to make all of you happy healthy so if you uh, like don't isolate yourself you will spread this thing more and more and they can't able to control and uh, that's a very bad thing so we have to respect the respect the uh, effort of all the medical uh, teams everywhere um, not not only in my country india like i'm talking about the whole globe everybody is doing their best uh, but like and don't blame anyone that for this person uh, like so this is a very catastrophic situation we have to you you we, we have to unite ourselves but making social distance we can able to only unite for the long time if we make social distance, otherwise we can't able to survive. So there is no point then. So I hope um, I am I'm a very simple person. Maybe I'm telling my point of view, but uh, uh, if I said anything nonsense, sorry for that. But uh, I'm just sharing this feeling with you because I feel uh, this is really a problematic situation for everyone and uh, uh, this virus actually affects the elder people and very uh, young people like uh, below 10 years and uh, after 60 years so we have actually responsibility to for our el elders and youngers not to spread this kind of virus and uh, again isolate yourself so stay healthy uh, be happy and I believe this is the time uh, you can actually look into yourself uh, you can do a lot of stuff right now which are actually pending from my side I can able to tell you uh, I'm not happy with the situation but isolating myself actually somewhat makes my uh, like some unfulfilled things whatever i can't able to do for a long time that i can manage to do right now so i'm trying to uh, i have i have finished some work long time ago i was trying to write down that paper and that paper is actually very long but i could couldn't able to manage time because i was traveling to us canada india giving talks and all here i am also busy in germany in whatever institute i am actually working the max planck now i have a time to write that thing and also work in many many projects with students discuss with them uh, spend a lot of time on my projects work and This kind of thing. And apart from that, as you guys already know, I actually sing and dance both. So I'm 
doing those things very frequently right now and posting those videos videos live videos in facebook as well as in youtube so guys uh, look into that if you want to spend your time then uh, you please look into that videos maybe uh, that will make you happy and this is kind of a small effort from my side to make you happy and uh, yeah like uh, please like those videos subscribe if you want there is i'm not actually uh, doing some kind of advertisement here but i truly believe that the small effort actually makes you happy so you can you guys also can do similar kind of thing like not recording maybe you can do for yourself you can sing you can actually um, do dance also and a uh, lot of things like i know dancing and singing that's why i'm telling you can do some kind of uh, like other things like you can cook different different stuffs you can actually experiment with the cooking a lot of thing you can do so uh, but yeah don't go outside also like uh, that is like here i have found that just in front of my institute uh, there is a big playground and people used to play sometimes even after uh, this situation is uh, appearing just last week uh, but today i found that there, there is a instruction that don't play any kind of games there so that it will not spread to anyone anybody else so everyone like not in india everyone trying to uh, help this kind of so you have to help yourself that's the main thing and you can help yourself only you can able to if you can able to isolate yourself so yeah so be happy be healthy and take care of yourself and your family and if you have any kind of symptoms please don't hide go to the medical team tell about your situation and take the necessary action so and those who were those who are actually traveling my strong suggestion is mostly from abroad to india or maybe some some like i don't know about the internal travel in europe i think it is not allowed right now but a lot of people are actually going from uh, europe america to india or maybe some other countries so if you go and if your taste is positive please isolate yourself don't spread this kind of thing to anybody you don't have any right to affect the whole humankind because if you do that then you will see that someday everybody will be finished very soon so think about this situation it's 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 a very problematic so maybe i'm talking nonsense to you but i'm very much uh, in pain after knowing whatever going on throughout the world so please take care bye have a nice day